Hello, Brian Knowlton back with another super cool slide rule tutorial. In this tutorial, we will learn what a heat sequencer is and how it operates. A heat sequencer is a device used to control the operation of electric heating elements, also known as heat strips. Heat sequencers are controlled by low voltage being applied to the coil terminals, designated here. The voltage applied to this coil must match the coil voltage requirement of the heat sequencer. In this example, the coil voltage is 24 volts AC. When 24 volts is applied to the coil, the normally open contacts, designated here and here, close, allowing electricity to flow through the terminals. The contacts do not close immediately, but are timed, usually from about 15 to 30 seconds apart. If one listens closely, the closing of the contacts can usually be heard. The voltage supplied to these contacts doesn't matter, but the maximum should be 240 volts. In this picture, we show a heat sequencer with four sets of contacts. This one can supply up to four separate heating elements. This other sequencer can supply only one heating element. This concludes our tutorial, but please stay tuned and let me introduce you to the super cool slide rule. This tool is guaranteed to save you countless hours, and saving hours saves money. Thanks for watching. Hello, I'd like to take a minute to introduce you to the coolest tool in the HVAC industry. Historically, technicians have carried four or five different slide rules. You have one for R22, one for R410A, one for metal duct sizing, one for flexible duct sizing, and yet others for diagnostics or troubleshooting. Thankfully, those days are gone. This one tool will allow you to charge a system with R22 or R410A and either the superheat or subcooling method. The back cover contains required formulas, it has capacitors, rules, and practices, a wet bulb conversion chart, how to perform computations on series or parallel circuits, an electric heat strip guide, a complete system troubleshooting diagnostic chart, and how to troubleshoot compressors in TXV. Inside is packed with even more information. It performs sizing of both metal and flexible duct. It has the only direct reading conversion from smooth metal to insulation line metal we've ever seen. The majority of technicians have never been taught that if the insulation is on the inside of the ductwork, you cannot size it with a regular duct calculator. It has step-by-step -step directions for determining airflow through a gas furnace, electric furnace, or an air conditioning unit. It has pressure drop multipliers for duct work, as well as recommended velocities. And finally, the scanning of this QR code gives instant access to over 100 tutorials to assist the technician with every test and repair imaginable. You owe it to yourself, as well as your customers, to own this tool. It's less than $20, including shipping. The SuperCool will save you countless hours of frustration when troubleshooting units. Log on to our website and get one today, and I promise you will be a better technician tomorrow. And remember, every technician is only as good as their tools. Thanks for watching.